Hello everyone, I hope you're having a great day today. Merciless Vaughn here back with another Dokkan battle video. And in this one, we're going to be showcasing the easy yay for the physical super Janimba here. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, leave a like. If you're new to the channel, you've been here for a while, you'll consider subscribing and help me get to 450 subscribers. Now with all that said, let's go ahead and jump in here. So um, my Janimba, he's not link level 10. This is the link levels that I have on him. I also do have one dupe in him, so he is at 69%. And basically what I did, I just gave him dodge and a little bit additional. I don't have his equips because I haven't done the um, new um, um, memorials battle um, stages. So I'll be doing those here pretty soon. And then I will be using his equips. Uh, yeah, these are his stats at 69% here. And just looking at his leader skill real quick. Corroded body, mind, or movie bosses. Category key plus four attack HP and defense 170. Not that that really matters. We have better leader skill units. So, yeah. So, taking a look at his 18 key here, Hell's Gate. This is 18 key. It's an other super attack and greatly raises attack and defense for one turn, causes mega colossal damage to enemy, and massively lowers defense. So, his 12 key is another other attack and a savage skewer. Raises attack and defense for one turn, causes mega colossal damage to enemy, and greatly lowers defense. Alright, so now we have his um, passive here. Key plus 6, attack and defense 166%. He just guards, and he also has 22% damage reduction, which is great. On is an additional attack that has a grand chance of becoming a super attack for one turn from the character's entry turn. Plus an additional key plus two up to six HP or excuse me attack and defense plus sixty six percent up to one hundred and sixty six percent chance of performing a critical hit plus twenty two percent up to sixty six percent with each attack performed plus an additional attack plus sixty six percent when key is twenty two or more plus an additional damage reduction of twenty two percent when the character is the first or second attacker in a turn on just an additional attack that has a great chance. Of becoming a super attack when the character is in the second or third attacker in the turn. There's a great chance to nullify key blast super attacks directed at the character, and he has a high chance of evading enemy super attacks. So that great chance is 70% if it's a key blast super, then I guess if that fails, we do have the 50% chance to dodge, which is pretty good. And uh, let's see here, he does have a rage mechanic here. Can be activated when HP is 66% or more starting from the 6th turn from the start of battle. If it was 6th six turn from his start of turn, that would be absolutely crazy. I don't think you would ever see that. So his rage mode, um, let's see here. His super attacks do change here. Uh, let's see, massively raises attack temporarily, causes... Destructive damage to enemy and all attacks become critical hits temporarily. Okay, and that's a weapon super attack. 12 key greatly raises attack temporarily, causes destructive damage to enemy and all attacks become critical. So when he goes into his rage mechanic, he just guaranteed critting, which is pretty good. Passive skill, ceaseless hell, changes all key spirits to physical key spirits, plus an additional key plus two per key spirit obtained, and attack plus 16% per key spirit obtained. So yeah, his rage mode is going to do a lot of damage that first hit. So if we do get to see that, that would definitely be great. So that's pretty much it for the character. We're going to go ahead and go into the uh, Supreme Magnificent Battle versus Super Saiyan Gohan team. Uh, we're using the um, Tech LR Broly team here. And I will be using the support memory. So let's just go ahead and jump in here. The reason I show this fight is because it's pretty lengthy, so we might be able to get his rage mechanic in here. So yeah, let's see what we can do with this Janimba. And it looks like he was in the second turn. Yabero Brody! 
All right, so here we are. Um, a good thing is we will have an LR Broly's um, domain on the uh, fifth turn, which is great. Uh, one thing I will say about the Janimba is um, he's probably more of a, I guess you could say a defensive oriented character, just because he does have a lot. He guards and just has damage reduction, which he knows is pretty good. I don't think there's a need to activate his domain like this soon, so I'm just not going to. Um, that's... Uh, I want to try and set up some rainbow key squares for STR. Oh yeah, he doesn't link that well with him, so I'll just do this. I don't think there's a need to pop the domain right now. S to it. I think I want to grab this. Oh my gosh, my fingers slipped so hard. I am so upset. Not as crazy. I slid my finger a little bit to the left right before I released it. I'm doing Janima first mostly because I'm going to save the best for last. Oh, we stun go through. That's great. And if you don't know, who, well, you know who I'm talking about. He's the best, obviously. Would have did a lot more damage had I not messed up my freaking key. Well, one super attack. Sure, I guess. So much is intro to play. Am I forgetting something? Super boss's artificial life form. Is he not an artificial life form? Oh wow. He's not an artificial life form. I do not have Cell Max's intro. I I don't know why I thought he was on artificial life forms. I is he Okay, well shoot. This is bad. Um Anyways, um, yeah, he needs to get built up, so he needs to do a, a, quite a few super attacks, so we'll, um, just... Dang, that actually sucks. So, we'll, I'll, I'll do this. I guess I'll target Videl. Jadima's not on artificial life forms. I guess that's just me not... That was my, my lack of game knowledge there, just kind of... So, if we die, we'll... I mean, what does he really get from his intro? Like, do we really need anything from his intro? Like, honestly, do we need anything? Let me see, what, what do we get from Cellmax's intro? 100% attack and defense and guards for three turns. I mean... I don't think we need it. It only lasts for three turns. So I guess... Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. I'm going to super attacks with that. I guess, we're, I mean, we're missing out on 100% extra attack and defense and a high chance to do a super attack, but that's only for like three turns, so I, I guess it's not, I don't want to say it's not that important, but oh, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we can go ahead and transform with him.
Uh, yeah, I still don't think there's a need to, um... Activate his domain. This is only the first stage. Huh, that's so weird. I, I just thought Janima was on artificial life forms. Hmm. Well, now I know, so... Uh, I mean, I don't know. I guess we'll finish off with them. Then take out Goten. Sure. I wasn't paying attention on me as super attacks. Oh, you know what, see, um, I was watching the um, producer's letter for Dokkan, and I did saw they were going to, like, have a feature in, like, the character detail screen that's going to keep track of, like, what the character's done. Like, how many additionals he did, if he's guarding, how many dodges he did. I guess, I think how many times he crit. I can't wait for that. Then I want to keep track of this all in my head. Nineteen million, really? He must have got that um, chance to massively increase his attack. Is it a massive? I don't know what it is. Twenty million. If he crits, Trunk should be a done for here. No crit. We do get the additional super. Yeah, I don't think we'll really miss Cell Max's intro too much. Uh, we already saw his intro, don't need to play it again. Um... Do I wanna... what do I wanna do here? Let's see what he's looking at right now. Almost a million attack, 624,000 defense, and I'm pretty sure he's not fully built up. I'm pretty sure he didn't do that many attacks. I think I'm going to go ahead and put him in slot one. It's only one rainbow key spear. I definitely want to give that to... Okay, that's still one, unfortunately. We're moving pretty slow here, but that's not too bad, because he does need to do a couple more super attacks. 17 new. So after this, he should definitely be fully built up now. And that was a crit, that's good. Supers or additional normals, it doesn't matter, he just needs to attack. So I'm pretty sure he should be fully built up now. We definitely want to get the Imp Broly's domain up to, to see what his damage will look like for sure. Then potential normal. Not getting lucky with the Rainbow Key Spears for him. It's taking him a while to get built up. But I guess as long as he gets there. Um, I don't think there's a... I mean, sure, I can use it here, I guess. Hold on, hold on a second. Wrong one. Doko e yukunda? Oh! The Gohan at the end of this is STR and he also does do Keyboy Super, so we'll definitely put him in slot one to see if he can um you know see if we can get that notification in the video. Twenty-three million. Yeah, I, I think we can. Since we're running double tech, LR Broly, we can just like use in Broly's domain towards the end. I think that should be okay. Oh. 
All right. Physical Gohan here. We do have his rage mechanic. Should we use it now or should we like just kind of save it? I think I want to save it. Uh, yeah, he's not sharing a lot of links. Legendary power, first battle, and shocking speed. He's definitely missing Big Bad Boss. Oh, Cell Max has Big Bad Boss, so I should probably get him on a rotation with him there. Okay, so we'll just put him in slot one. We can get that. We'll grab that. And then we can also grab that. Alright, let's see how much damage he's outputting. Oh, we didn't check his stats. Should have checked them. 16 million. Okay, yeah. He does have big bad bosses. And he only has a three of his links up, so... Yeah. But we are getting some benefit from his um, defensive lower. He's kind of, I wouldn't say like the oddball on this team. I say that because he doesn't really have the best of links up with anybody here. So I think we definitely do need to get him and Cell Max together for big bad bosses. Oh, he's defensive lowering too. That's cool. Normals. There I go. Uh, we need to be below a certain HP threshold. Dang. So no big bad bosses. This is why getting your links to level 10 is very important. But besides that, yeah, he's just still the same old links. Unfortunate. Nice dodge. So I guess we want to kind of do take a tad bit of damage here. Not too much, though. I mean, we might. They, this... He still has not super. I'm afraid he's gonna super sell Max in the back here. If he did that, I'd be very upset. Okay, there he is. He'll be fine. Yeah. Only did 12 damage. Nice crit. I think I'm going to have to, like, I don't know, maybe find out who he links up with very well. Well, actually, I can look right now while he's attacking. So he links up really well with Wuhan. Oh, snap. I forgot about this. Uh, we can just probably go ahead and turn these off now. Uh, healing better with him right there. I guess we're getting a dope on attack with him, sure. If he supers here, we might see the key blast notification. So, supering, maybe? No, he didn't super. This will probably kill. So the next phase, the last phase is physical, or STR, so he will have type disadvantage, so we do need to be probably a bit careful. Let's see, if this crits, it might do a decent amount of damage. It didn't crit, but 23 million. Alright, that is the last phase. Um... Yeah, we can just pretty much go ahead and uh, do this now. Nice crit. I 
I won't use Selmax's active here. I think he should be okay. Hope I don't regret saying that. Alright, let's see. Is he gonna super swap one off rip? Okay, no he doesn't. Okay, never mind. Yes, he does. Alright, so he just guarantees super swap one. Yeah, okay. He'll obviously be fine. Did I say he'd be fine? I lied. 121,000 with his guard up. Well, if we do take some damage, we might see Berserker, but we definitely don't want to die. That's for sure. I'll probably skip some of this stuff out just so we can like see uh, Janema gameplay. I probably won't show everything here. Because this is taking quite a bit of time. Oh, nice. We're actually doing pretty good damage. So yeah, Selmax is fully built up now. So we'll play this. And then we will also play this. Alright, so... So as you saw there, he did change the entire field into physical key spears, and he is getting 16% attack with every... What was it? Key spear obtained? Yeah, every key spear obtained. So let's go ahead and just see what he's doing here. Oh, oh, sure, this won't do anything. How much damage does this do, I wonder? We should see it. That super only does 2.6 million? Mm -hmm. 18 million? This is a guaranteed crit, too. This OST really fits this Janimba. Now, the other Janimba's damage won't be that much because we didn't collect that full field of uh, physical key spirits and we didn't get that many other key spirits either, unfortunately. Now, is it, how many turns is this? I think it's only for one, one turn. Yeah, it's only for one turn. Alright, so if I'm correct, he shouldn't super just because he super while we were enraged. So we'll just go ahead and kill him here. Yeah, he didn't super. Yeah, okay. 14 million with the domain up. Ten million on a crit, nice. Unfortunately he only gave us one super. 61 million. Oh, I put the wrong bro in the slot too. Oh. It didn't crit. Oh, it doesn't matter. Alright, cool. Very nice. Alright, so that was a brief showcase of the new EZA uh, physical Super Janimba. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching, and as usual, until next time.